by sun's up and we're halfway between McKenney and the Guinea border. We're traveling up to that uh, remote part to see what it is that Street Child is doing on the educational front for kids that can't get to school, mainly because there aren't any schools up in those remote areas. Out of all the remote locations in Sierra Leone, why did Street Child choose Tambaca as the place to begin its rural education project? Because Tambaca is the largest and poorest chieftain in Sierra Leone, and the school attendance rates were the worst in the country, something simply had to be done. Our first stop is a school in the village of Salakunda. Sitting down under the shade of a big mango tree, we've had a chance to listen to the head teacher and hear how having a school in their town has changed the lives of everyone, not just the children. Uh, when we first came to Tambaka in 2010 or 2009, there were basically three functional schools. And uh, in all these schools, there were only two teachers who were still unqualified. And today, we are talking of uh, uh, well, nearly 200 teachers now. So you can just imagine what a big difference that, uh, that, that has been. You may think that building the school and bringing in the teachers and training them and getting the pupils in is all that matters when you're trying to educate the children in a local community. That's only half the answer. To sustain it year after year after year, you've got to somehow generate income to pay the wages and all the other expenses. And that's why I'm sitting on what is effectively the profit of the ground nut, the peanut, harvest last year. It's not rocket science, it doesn't have to be. It's a very neat, simple business model the key thing is the profit comes to the school and the profit is enough to run the school year after year after year. The building's up, the teachers are trained and guess what, here's the payroll. For Street Child a wonderful window has opened but it's not a very big window. It's from March the 15th to June the 15th. The British government has said, Street Child, whatever you raise, we'll double it. We'll double it. And remember, you don't have to give a great deal. We'd like if you would actually give quite a lot, but every pound or 100 pounds or 1,000 pounds that you hand over, the British government will double it. Do it.